All right, everybody, we are working through the quadratic functions and equations review, and this is question 11. Uh, it's multiple choice. It says the, gra the quadratic function uh, f of x equals x squared is transformed into g of x equal to negative 2 thirds x plus 3 squared plus 6. The point 636 on the graph of f is transformed into what gra uh, point on the graph of g of x? Okay, so what we're going to do here is we're taking we're taking 636 and we're going to transform it. Now, the transformations here, when you take a look at those, we've got to just identify what's going on here. This negative and this two-thirds, they are two separate transformations. That is a, a reflection and this is a stretch. But because they're both outside the squaring, because these happen after the squaring, these are vertical. And so what we're going to see here is on our point here, what I'm doing is I am taking and multiplying the y-coordinate by a negative and two-thirds. Inside the function, inside the squaring, this because the x plus 3 happens prior to the squaring, this is a horizontal trans, uh, transformation. And because I'm adding 3 inside here in the function, if I think about what I would do to get x by itself, I would subtract 3. And so to get the point here, what's happened here is this thing has moved 3 to the left. And that's, that's how I write that, 3 to the left, x minus 3. Finally, outside the squaring, I'm adding 6. Now, because it's happening outside the square, that means this is a vertical transformation, so I'm going to add 6 to the y. Now, that's all I need, and all this does is, is reflect exactly what I, I see as of the transformations in here, and now I take the point 636 and just plug it in. What is 6 minus 3? 3. What is negative 2 thirds of 36? Okay, well, 36 divided by 3 is 12, times negative 2 is negative 24, plus 6 is going to be negative 18. So that's the point that I'm looking for. That's the new point here. And actually, I could see it right away here, uh, just off to the side. That was, that was option C.